It's Famous Fat Dave coming at you. And when I'm not busy driving this cab, I'm out there trying some of the best there is to offer in holiday foods. Which means I get to try places like Rickshaw Dumpling Bar. Dumplings are a universal treat you're likely to find on the menu at any Chinese New Year celebration. Why is it that dumplings are uh, such a traditional Chinese Lunar New Year treat? Well, the Chinese always eat um, symbolic foods to help them have a good year to come. Ah. And we will eat dumplings because they're like little purses full of good goodness. Mm. And they resemble gold ingots, which is the old Chinese um, money form. And so by eating these, you should have a prosperous New Year. And dumplings are from the north. In the north, because that's where they grow flour. Ah. Should we start making dumplings? Absolutely. New Year's just around the corner. Let's do it. Well, here we have some peeled and deveined shrimp. And what I'm going to do is put it directly into my food processor. I'm not going to put right. all of it. And into that, I'm going to put a little bit of oyster sauce, some sugar, a little bit of grated ginger. And then this is a little bit of grated garlic, uh, a little salt. Just a tiny bit of pepper. I like to put a little bit of chili sauce in there just for yeah. a little kick. And this is some soy sauce. And then I'm gonna put a little bit of uh, potato starch, which will help to bind it. And what you wanna do is let it run till it, it forms a ball. A ball? So why are we doing shrimp on, on Chinese New Year? Well, some people um, do a pork, but the shrimp is symbolic of laughter. The, the name um, shrimp in Chinese is a homonym for what people sound like when they're laughing. Okay. So if you eat it on the New Year, you will have a year full of laughter. Year full of laughter, I could, I could use that. Here's some uh, scallion, there's some green scallion. This is some jicama. And so this is just gonna add some crunch and maybe that little faint sweetness to mm. it. And then into that, I'm gonna add the rest of the shrimp. Now we just have to fold it. The duck fold is actually the most traditional for this okay. time of year. So you put, wanna put like a heaping tablespoon of the mixture inside. Okay. And then what you wanna do is just take a little bit of water and uh -huh. you wet the edges. So from there, you're gonna make a sort of taco and you're going to pleat just one side. Uh. A little pleats. Now, what is the, the wrapping made out of? It's uh, flour and water. Just flour and water, and yeah. that's what you get. That's it. Cool. I'm doing so badly. <laughs> Let's make two more so we have a lucky six. OK. I'm going to add a little bit of water, and then I'm just going to let it cook. Every culture has its dumplings. What is it about the, the meal in a because everyone wants to be like the Chinese. Oh, okay, that's what it is. <laughs> you hear it? Yes, I do. Okay. A little crackling. Beautiful, right? I think this is one that I did, actually, right? The beauty is on the inside. Right, okay. All right, well, let's dip. Happy New Year to you. Happy New Year to you. Mmm. It's gonna be a good year. <laughs> Holiday foods. That's dumplings.